What's going on, YouTube? Clay Huzol back again with another My Hero Ultra Impact video. It's actually my first one since the global release. I know what you guys are saying. Where was the tier list? Where was the reroll video? Listen, Lost Art came out, and I'm obsessed with that game. I'm playing so much of that game. And I knew that I need I could have this game on the back burner. You know, it is a mobile game. Uh, this is a mobile gaming channel. But I knew that I could really grind in Lost Ark. And then when there was Lost Ark downtime like there is now, I could get, sink my teeth into this. It just sucks. It's just my luck. Every time I go on vacation, every time a game releases, it's either when I'm on vacation or like eight games come out at the same time. Just like this. A game I've been waiting for comes out when another game I've been waiting for. So yada, yada, yada. You don't need to hear my life story. Let's talk about what I rerolled for. So in this game, rerolling is extremely easy if you want to give it a try. You literally load up the game game they take you right to the re-rolling you can re-roll as many times as you want on a 10 pull now that um character roster is limited you can check the drop drop rates there are two teams i would suggest or two duos i would suggest going for the one i have here is bakugo and momo they're both blue characters um the reason being bakugo is an extremely powerful unit very very high damage dealing unit momo is a healing support but she buffs blue units. Bakugo needs to have his health above 50% to output his maximum damage. So he's going to want to have a healer with him. So buffing a blue unit being Bakugo. And then also healing. Momo's healing. So that's going to be what makes this team good. The other team I would go for would be um, Ochako. Which is a green Ochako who is also a healer. So pretty much the blue Momo. The green uh, o Ochako excuse me, is going to be very similar. And then the pair with that healer in the... Um, the green Ochako is going to be Todoroki. He's a green Todoroki unit, kind of the same thing, needs HP up. Uh, sh uh, Ochako buffs green units. So it'd be the two duos I would go for if you're going to reroll. There's obviously green Hawks. There's a bunch of other characters that are really cool. Go for who you like. You can reroll as many times as you want. Get as many URs as you want. UR memories, all that good stuff. Before we continue with the rest of the video with the new event and the new banner, I do want to say that this game is being released in tandem with Jap Japan. So it sounds weird because Japan's been out for like almost a year now, right? They are releasing us caught up to Japan. So this new banner we're about to go look at with Nejuri, this banner is uh, the same one that's out in Japan for my understanding. You can correct me in the comments below. So we're not going to be held behind. It's for some reason my iPad freezes on this video. I don't know why. And sometimes it loads. I, I really don't get... I, whatever. We'll, we'll continue with that later. But anyway, so this game, every new banner we get is going to be what Japan gets. And so... That really puts a new perspective on like a global launch because normally you know exactly what to go for. We know all the greatest units. Well, now the best units are going to be to come and they're going to be coming out later. So if we go ahead and look at this unit, she's an insane support unit and she's new. She's fancy. Everybody wants her. And let me tell you why. Okay, let's look into her for a little bit. Her ultra impact move or plus ultra move um, is deal 600% damage to a single opponent. Increases plus ultra gauge of all allies, which is the ultimate, which is what she's using by 20 percent it doesn't include herself so she doesn't get to keep like reoccurring it up and then uh she also regenerates hp of all allies so again she's a support type unit yes all support units can deal damage but she's going to be a healer who also buffs her team and we'll see that here her two action skills first one coming up restores hp of a single ally by 25 percent increases power of that ally by 30 percent so increasing damage they'll deal and then restores hp of all allies by 25 percent a six turn to cooldown so it's like a super heal because you're healing everybody and you're healing specifically this unit. And then you're also increasing that unit's power by 30%. So it's like a power buff up along with healing. Uh, her next ability is called Power Wave. Deals 250% damage to all opponents. Decreases power of all opponents by 25%. Also increases plus ultra gauge of all allies by 15%. This move, These moves are insane, guys. So think about it. You're, you're, you're breaking the opponent's attack. You're dealing damage and you're buffing up your entire team. Uh, they're plus ultra gauge. So essentially they're plus ultra gauge. They're ultimate. You want to be spamming that as much as possible. It's the hardest hitting ability. She has that, uh, in spades here with, as you saw with their plus ultra ability. And now you're seeing it with the action skills. Okay. Looking at her auto skills, you do want to build her, you know, you don't have to, but the game, you know, they like to build teams. And so in this case, if you have UA high students, uh, as your allies, they're going to get 25% of their plus ultra gauge and start a battle. And then her other auto skill is regenerates HP of all allies by 20% for three turns when a wave starts. So, you know, right when you get into the wave, it's going to put this regenerating buff on everybody. Also, once per battle, gives a character ability to make a last stand one time when HP blows 50%. Or HP falls below, excuse me, 50%. Which means someone's going to get guts, as you guys know, from FFBE, which is absolutely insane. This unit is freaking dope, dude. So... So we're to give a little review on this. I've been talking really fast. I've been talking a lot because I just want to get to the summons. You have to know that she's one of the strongest units in the game right now, even though we are caught up with uh, Japan. 
again she's coming out in japan japan we get the uh you know the courtesy and the privilege of just going straight forward instead of having to wait so we're gonna go ahead and get in here we're gonna do as many summons as we can because there is a king mod type event for my ffbe players uh where we collect medals and the characters and the memories you get from here are going to be useful there again guys if this game is something you guys like i'll do a more in-depth review of the memories of the characters but you know this is my first video so try to cram a lot into it and just have fun so let's get our first summon in here and hope we can pull this ur unit i do believe the rates are two percent for URs, so let's see how this goes down and i i think if all might does his your next move that means that we get a ur i think so there's a lot of different things this is way better than the strongest hero when it comes to summoning animations we get the memories popping up and we want it to keep going and if he points oh he didn't point so i don't know if that means i can't get it or it could happen later okay so okay so he didn't point so i don't know if that means that we're not going to be getting a ur or that just means it's not guaranteed like it wasn't a giveaway you know what i mean so we're getting a lot of our characters <laughs> a lot of our uh our ranks holy moly okay this might be the most dud first pull ever this is my first pull ever in the game i haven't spent any of my crystals or anything like that okay we got an escar uh grand torino here i think that was the end because i was guaranteed okay dude so that was a bad 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 first pull let's pick it up let's keep going we got four more we can do to try to get this awesome support also, I think she looks okay in game. The chippies are like, ah, the chippies, I don't know. I don't know why they had to make them all chippy looking, but she doesn't look too bad, her model. That's another thing I wanted to talk about. All right, guys, come on. And I also do believe their costumes at the beginning have some significance, right? They can either be in their schools. They could be in their, like, you know, casual clothes. They could be in, come on. Oh, my gosh. It didn't even, it did nothing, dude. Uh, this could be bad. Let's see. Oh, no. <laughs> okay well there we go i got some uh, medals there because that was a copy okay this is not working out i love the art in this i love my hero academia so the art in this game of course i'm gonna really enjoy hi i'm just drinking a soda all right okay an sr okay another sr well at least it was better than the first pull see we upgraded we went from one sr to two srs so let's hope we can just get it to be a little bit better we got three pulls come on man okay they're back in their school cut i think their school outfits are like again like i said it, it, i don't know if they're in their hero outfits if it's even better but when i see the school outfits so far disappointment is what that means all right here we go come on all might save me buddy let's see okay keep going yes go again don't 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 let me down no can he pop up right here if it just goes straight wait 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 it, 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 the light the light okay that, that was a little bit different right because it, it, it took a second it took a second whoa let's be friends we got a ur memory right here i have no idea what it does but it'll be interesting to see back to back ur memories to our future heroes let's go dude okay sr girls love sweets <laughs> Okay, no, 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 you can't punch me like that. Uh, okay. A little bit more flair on there. Okay, that, that, that's the bare bones minimum, <laughs> Todoroki. Oh, man. Okay, this one was way better, obviously. We have two new UR memories, back to back. Can I view them on here or no? Oh, I can. Uh, let's see, skill. Increases character speed by 30%. Also, if the character's skill impact by uh, 30%, if there are uh, any other female characters on the team. Okay, so again, you have to build around the team. Uh, and you want to have a female in there, and they, they, their speed is up. So they get to take their uh, turns faster, I guess is what speed means. Again, I'm not an expert in this game yet. I just got really into it. So let's see. Increases character's critical hit rate by 20% and power by 20% when equipped by a male character. Okay, so this goes on a male character. It just makes them stronger. It seems like a perfect thing for my Bakugo. I really like that. Probably going to be slapping that on my Bakugo. Not too bad. Uh, so now let me take a look real quick and see what the ur memories are because i don't know if those were just straight up do i scroll down okay so we're gonna keep scrolling down there is a um let's see okay so adventure awaits which is again i think that's from an ending in my hero they had that as an ending and then girls love sweets is the sr okay so i got girl love sweets but i didn't get the banner specific adventure awaits so uh, that was just, just two generic ones well let's hope we can get a banner unit <laughs> that would be very very nice but at least I have the girls uh, love sweets so that I can use that uh, in the essentially event to get the medal so I can trade them into the shop. Oh, 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 
Oh, I didn't even see. They're in their U. Uh, I kept say kept saying they were in their UA costumes. They were just in their school costumes. This is their UA costumes. I'm just so excited. My mind's all over the place. Come on. Uh, but all my didn't point last time. It did some kind of flash here. Okay, this this, this just seems bad. <laughs> this just seems like it's gonna be another one of those dud pulls. No, dude. Okay. 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 Nope. You you know when they don't have any flair to them, it's just bad. This is SR. Okay, we're not at the end of the pool yet. That's probably it. Just one more job. Dang it, dude. Okay, guys. I need you guys to put your hands together and pray for me real quick because I'm going to need some kind of miracle to get through this. Now, we got a ton of story. We have the events of farm to get more pulls. But now we are... That was... I think this is our fifth pull here. Fifth pull here. Hope something, something good happens. And again, hopefully we see them in their, like, full-on hero costumes. Oh, God, no. They're in their crap costumes, guys. Why is this happening to me? <laughs> no, dude. No. It would suck if this... Well, we already saw they did this, and we got two UR memories. So it's not fully determined from this. Come on. Yes. Keep going. Now, another one. We haven't seen it here on this video yet. No, and we're not going to see it. No! And it went quick, dude. It went quick. Okay. Yeah, that's who I wanted. Ooh. Dang. It hurts, dudes. <laughs> it hurts, bros. Well, we tried, man. You can't you can't have all the luck at the beginning of the game, right? We got our we got our two URs in the box. Oh my gosh, that was sick. That is sick art right there. Okay, that's the end of that. Dang it, man. Um, well, you know, we did the best we could. And again, it's a two per I do believe now I'm gonna check again drop rates. I'm pretty sure it's two percent. See, SR uh drop rates. Yeah, two percent for the memory and the character. So I got really lucky on that one to get two UR memories. And then she is up by uh 0.7% is her drop rate. So she is up. If you would try to get an off banner now let's look at these exchange points right here if i get up to 300 of them and i'm at 61 i do get to hit pity and i get to get her so that would take a lot of pulls that's a lot of pulls for a pity but i guess at least the pity's there right for anybody out there who is going to pull that much but i'm really just going to keep farming get some more free currency and i am going to spin it all into her because i think she's actually pretty broken and again guys like i was talking about before maybe i'll do another video on this but if you guys go to quest i don't know if i have it unlocked yet i do go to event you when you do this event here which now i don't even want to skip through this because i want to watch it um you will need to use the units that you get on the banner etc it will increase how many medals you get again similar to a key mog if you guys have seen that in ffb but i think this video is going on long enough i'm gonna go dry my tears and maybe one day pull in all my that'll make me feel really good uh but yeah so so far i'm liking the game there are some critiques to it i have and maybe i'll put a review out it's not exactly the best game in the world um, because I think we're just so limited like it has the right things with like taking down attack buffing speed buffing up attack Etc. I like buffs and debuffs, but they don't have enough abilities for each character that are like Controlled by me I guess like you saw that we have two auto skills and then we have two like main skills you have ultimate I wish there were more than that, you know games are more usually more successful when they have more than that Anyway talking to your guys heads off have a good day out there today uh, Let me know how your pulls went if you ended up getting her She's very very powerful So if you guys like this video give it a thumbs up comment down below if you're enjoying the game How you feel about the game what you're doing with it subscribe for future content and I'll catch you guys in the next video